October is Cybersecurity Awareness Month. With the college experience increasingly moving online, I asked Information Security Officer Amanda Williams of Pittsburgh State University what risks students are facing. For students, and I'm really for anyone, I mean, any um, business, organization, students, personal, is really ransomware. You're hearing a lot about ransomware in the news right now. Um, so some of the things that you can do to protect yourself against ransomware, kind of the big cybersecurity topics, um, would be to have a good, long, strong password. Um, keeping your systems up to date, like your operating system on your computer, your browsers, and then any apps that you use, making sure those are all current. One thing we've been seeing a lot is phishing, um, P-H-I-S-H-I-N-G, um, which is where somebody who is wanting to get our information sends an email out that looks like it's from one of our upper management or like offices and stuff like that. And when you click on the link and sign in, it's not an actual sign-in page and your information is getting stolen. So Gus verifies kind of what we've called our, you know, here at Pitt State, called our multi-factor authentication solution. It's powered by Duo Security. Um, we rolled it out, probably it's been about three years ago for all faculty and staff, so they've been using it for the last three years. Um, it currently in the process of rolling it out for all students. So anytime you log into your Pitt State accounts, you're going to be asked to verify that you are who you are. While you should try to stay safe the entire year round, this month is about informing students of the steps they should take to keep their data in the right hands. For CAPS 13 News, I'm Jordan Keyes.